Hi everyone and welcome to another vlog. Today we are in London for a meeting and of course I had to stop off at Primark. We're starting off in the pyjama section and I've had so many comments asking me to look for the Riverdale range and they have these pyjamas for only £12. They also have this pyjama top for £7 and the pyjama bottoms are £10. This is also part of the Riverdale pyjama range. You can get this long sleeve top for £8. Also for £8 you can get the match and bottoms. Disney Thumper pyjamas, you can get the top for £6 and the bottoms for £8. But if you prefer shorts, you can get those for £6. They have a Game of Thrones range, you can get this loungewear top for £8. This pyjama set for £12 and this is the design on the bottoms. They have this fleecy top for £10. Moving down, they have trousers for £8. They have this pyjama top for £6 and this nightshirt for £11. In the Stranger Things pyjama range, they have this jumper for £10. Moving down, they have pyjama bottoms for £8. They have this night dress for £10. These jogging bottoms are £10. Moving across, you can get this set for £7. Slippers are £5. And here, they have this night dress for £6. They have a new Pinocchio range, you can get this pyjama set for £7, this pyjama top for £6, they have this night shirt for £12 and they have this crop top for £4. If you know someone getting married, they have a bridal range in Primark now. You can get this bride-to-be rosette for £2, this pack of eight mini bubbles for £1. These are perfect for favours. They also have pyjamas for £5. In the same range they have flip flops for £2, you can choose from this design or this bride to be design. They also have brides and bridesmaids dressing gowns, these are £15 each but they don't look the best material. They also have this weekender bag for £14 which reads bride to be. If you know someone planning an engagement party you can get 8 paper cups for £2, also for £2 you can get 8 paper plates. For £1.50 you can get 16 paper napkins, they have the 16 paper straws for £2, also for £2 they have photo props. In the baby section they have a Bambi range, you can get this comforter for £4, this pack of muslin squares, these are £4 and this blanket for £6. Look how adorable this Lion King set is and it's only £6. That's really good value for the jumper and the trousers. If you know a child who loves Minecraft, they have pyjamas in two different designs for £10. They also have a range of t-shirts and the t-shirts are £6 each and they also have backpacks for £10. Also in the Minecraft range, they have this five pack of boys briefs for £4.50, three pairs of socks for £2.30, or you can get these trainer socks for £2. Moving down, they have this two pack of boxer shorts for £4.50, shorts for £8. Across here, they have this hoodie for £12, sunglasses for £2.50, and this hat is £6. I've had a request to show handbags, they have these ones, this one is blush pink or you can get the same design in black for £8, they also have this one for £6. They have see-through bags in black and white for £8 each and these are really popular with people going to concerts so they can see everything you have in your bag. This would be a good alternative to a bum bag if you're going on a holiday and these are £6 each and you can get them in black or this khaki colour. This design is also £8, you can get it in black and brown. Lots of backpacks, they have the see-free ones for £8 in black and white. They also have this design for £8 in black or brown. And also this design. This is £10, you can get this beigey blush pink colour or black. If you're going to Disney World, this would be perfect to take to Animal Kingdom. It's great because it's a small bag so it doesn't take long to get searched. 
and it's animal print so you'll be on theme and this is £10. If you like Winnie the Pooh and Stationery, they have an entire range. You can get this set of highlighters for £2, two pack of pens for £2, or you can get this gold Winnie the Pooh pen for £2. This filled pencil case is £3. This larger pencil case is also £3. They have this pack of free notebooks for £2, phone cases for £3. They even have staplers. These are three pounds. Magnetic to-do list for two pounds. Pencil pots, these are five pounds, I believe. Yep, five pounds. And notebooks. They also have these weekly planners for three pounds. We're now going in the Harry Potter section. Hogwarts suitcases, they have them in two different designs. You can choose from this one or this one for 35 pounds each. They have lots of backpacks, they have this Ravenclaw one and this Hufflepuff design for £12. They have this Harry Potter design for £14 and they also have this design for each house and these are also £14. If you're lucky enough to be travelling to Orlando to visit the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, you can get this neck cushion for the plane for only £6 and this eye mask which is £3. Harry Potter pens for each house. You can get Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw and Slytherin and these are £2 each. They also have these hardback weekly planners and I think they are adorable. Only £3 each. You can even get hairbrushes in each house design for £3.50 each. Set of two cosmetic bags. In this store they have Slytherin, Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff and these are £6 each. Lots of different designs of socks and these are £2.50 a pack. They also have these Converse style shoes for only £12 and I believe these go up to adult size 8. They even have Harry Potter face masks and you can choose from two different designs and these are £2 each. They even have different designs of wand pens and these are £1.50 each. Cushions, you can choose from this Harry Potter cartoon design for £8 or any of these designs for £6. This set of earrings is only £2 and they also have this set of pins for £3. They have a new hair care range, you can get different hairsprays for £2.50 each. For £3.50 you can get this hair oil and they also have shampoo, conditioner and masks and these range from £3.50. Lots of lip balms, you can choose from Sprite, Coca-Cola, Reese's, Mentos, Pepsi and down here they have Sherbet Fountain, Refreshers and Jolly Rancher and these start at only £1 each. They have an adult minion range and this reminds me a little bit of Gucci. Let me know if you think the same in the comments below. They have these shorts, these are £7, the hoodies are £16 and the t-shirts are £6. They have an entire wellness range and there's so many different body creams, candles, diffusers to choose from and they start from only £3. And they also have this bath bar. Now this would be perfect for Mother's Day. And this is £13. Also in the wellness range, they have these travel jars for £3. And this travel bottle set for £3.50. And they have a clothing. And the clothing starts from only £8. Unfortunately, I don't have time to show you the entire wellness range today. But this is a little glimpse. We now have to leave Primark because I have a meeting at one o'clock in Vauxhall, which is quite a distance away. So we're now going to rush to the tube. Me and Holly have just got off the tube on the Victoria line and basically we're now waiting for our Uber. But I saw on the uh, little underground passages they have to walk through, there was a busker as, you know, you regularly see but this one was really clever he actually had a contactless card machine with an automatic two pound tip so you could you know you just walk past beep your card i reckon he makes a fortune in a day probably yeah yeah that that guy's gone places
We're now finished with our meeting and we've decided to come to the float works which is right behind me and apparently this is really good for your health. It's a tub which is full with I believe half a ton of Epsom salt so you just float. Really good for like your mental well-being and sore muscles which I have a lot of so we're now heading in. This is your home for the next hour. Wow. So you're in the water, I'd like you both to lay your head back in the door end. Yeah. As you lay back, you'll feel yourself float. Mm -hmm. Now if you put your arms in this position to start with, this is the cactus position. Yeah. Get your shoulders back, chest out, helps with your breathing, helps your head relax into the water. Okay. But you might experience a bit of tension in the neck and shoulders because we carry a lot of stress here. Yeah. So we recommend the first time is actually when you get in, behind your head, go yeah. back straight away, this does all the work for you. If you're feeling great, press the black button on the left, it's a light switch, it turns the light off, press it again, the light comes on. You okay. can turn the light on or off, it's up to you. Okay. But we recommend light off, lid shut for the best flow experience. I'm now about to get in and go for my float. Look how amazing that looks. I'm a little bit nervous, but apparently this is great for your mental state, also great for aching muscles, which I have a lot of in my neck, so I'll let you know how it goes after the float. Oh my word, that was incredible. I thought I was going to get anxious as soon as I put the lid down, but I just floated away and relaxed. After each session, the pod self-cleans itself, so this is what all the swishing is. Just got a text message from Callum saying he's waiting for me out the front. They also have this section where you can do your hair, like dry it and straighten it. So I'm going to give this a quick blast. This is the hair and makeup room and how awesome. They even have GHD straighteners. I mean, there's everything you need here. Body lotion, cotton buds for your ears. I mean, this place is prepared. So we're now at the station and they have a little lush store and I'm stocking up with toothpaste jelly because I love this stuff and they don't have it in our local store. I have my Lush goodies. I'm really excited to try the new flavours of toothpaste and I've also got my favourite which is Angels on Bare Skin and we're now in Leon because they have a really good gluten-free menu. We did try this a couple of weeks ago when we were in London but I've just seen they've got gluten-free chicken nuggets and I fancy chicken nuggets so we're just waiting for them to be cooked up and then we're getting on the 7pm train, which is the fast train to Norwich. Only takes an hour and a half. We got a takeaway order at Leon and they haven't put any cutlery. And me and Callum have rice. I've got a plan. Right. Really? It's going to involve you and some sauce. What? So I eat the sauce <laughs> and then you the scoop it up with it? Yes, because I am that hungry over all you. <laughs> How can you eat that? Oh, Callum. We've got 10 minutes remaining on the train, so I'm doing a Instagram live. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll leave my handle in the corner, but say hello everybody. Say hello to the vlog. I think there's a bit of a lag. There you go. Alice says hello. Jamie says hello. We're all saying hi. We are finally home after an exhausting day in London. I'm so glad I had the float works experience just to have that hour of chill time because I'm gonna be up most of the night with baby. He's already crying. He tends to stay awake from six till nine and then he does like every three to four hours. So I am up quite a lot. Hopefully he'll go longer stints as he get older. But yeah, at the minute it's a bit tough. So at least I had the relaxation earlier. So it's now time to call it a night. So until next time, I will see you soon. Bye.